Hello everyone, in this quick complex number lesson you're going to learn how to find the modulus of complex numbers. So let's define a complex number z as let's say 3 plus 2i and if you guys remember how to represent this on the argon diagram we have the real number plane and the imaginary plane and the real part of this number is 3 so 0, 1, 2, 3 and the imaginary part is 2 so 1, 2 and this number is represented by a dot um, called Z now the modulus of this complex number basically is the length of the line joining the origin and the point Z. So if I draw a straight line from where the origin is to this point, straight line, then the length of this line is the modulus. And if you remember um, Pythagoras theorem, okay, if you pretend that this is a right angle triangle, okay, if you pretend this is a right angle triangle and we have the right angle here, then we can say this is A, this is B, this is C, and we can figure out what C is from using Pythagoras, which is A squared plus B squared. Okay, so in this case, the length, the modulus of Z, the length of C is equal to 3 squared plus 2 squared square root. Okay, so the modulus of Z, which is denoted by Z with two vertical lines um, around it, is equal to 3 squared plus 2 squared square root which is equal to the square root of 9 plus 4 which is 13 okay now um, if we wanted to find a general uh, formula for it so for example if z was equal to a plus B I, then the modulus of Z would be equal to um, the square root of A squared plus B squared. Okay, that's a general formula for it. Um, so you could also have a symbol like um, using the modulus symbol but just put the complex number inside it so instead of Z you could just put in here 3 plus 2 I and then you would basically mean basically do the same thing to find out the modulus you would go square root of 3 squared plus 2 squared which is square root of 13 to find um, the modulus. Okay, so if you have two complex numbers, you could also, for example, let's define W as uh, 3 minus 5i and U as um, 2 minus 4i and you could have a question like this find the modulus of W minus U okay so what you would do is you would find W minus what W minus U is first so W minus U is um, 3 minus 5i minus 2 minus 4i 
which is 3 minus 5i minus 2 plus 4i so it's 1 minus i and then you would put that inside the modulus function and then you would use the Pythagoras theorem so you would go uh, 1 squared plus negative 1 squared so basically it's just 1 plus 1 which is 2 square root of 2 is the modulus of 1 minus i Okay, so thanks for watching this tutorial. See you guys next time.